Good morning and welcome to my apple tree. Thank you for being a Patreon member. This apple tree did not give us any apples last year because we had cold spring and hard frost late in the year. This year, we obviously have beautiful apples. First year I came here, these were a mid-sized apple and they turned red and they were beautiful and wonderful to eat. And when we're growing apple trees, you want to remember to thin out and prune the center of the tree so that you get lots of light. Now most apple trees you keep a central leader so you don't make an open vase but you want the, all the dead wood out and any branches that are crossing need to come out so that you get plenty of light because the light that comes in is what's going to create the flower bulb, the bud for next year. So this tree as you can look up in here you can see how it's getting pretty thick but I pruned it a couple of years ago and opened it up. So now it's ready for another pruning. Usually trees take about, uh, you know, maybe two years between prunings. If you're gonna be a really specific good fruit farmer, you will be pruning every year to make sure that the, the foliage is opened up and you have plenty of wood uh, that is fruiting wood that can get light. And how do you know what fruiting wood is? It's your outside branches. If you look deep inside, there's very little apples on the inside. Most of the apples are on the outside branches of the tree. So those are things to keep in mind. The other thing on having that tree, there's a perfect example right here. The, see a branch that's going straight up like this? That's a branch we would take out. Any branches that are going straight up, this one right here, very vigorous. All of that growth is this year and it's almost three feet tall. So that one would come out. Hopefully this helps you to grow an apple on your apple tree.